So I just saw an ad for Proposition B in Missouri that apparently is a proposition to raise the minimum wage. I would like to plead with you, please do not raise the minimum wage. This would be a very bad thing for the people who actually earn minimum wage and certainly for anybody who's on a retirement or a limited budget. Now, they had a bunch of women going on about uh, being single mothers and how they wanted um, to uh, to earn more on minimum wage so that they can buy more food for their children. But you know what? It's not going to work that way. Very recently, just very recently, I was a single mother, um, and I mean a really single mother, um, in Missouri. Uh, my daughter was two when we moved to Missouri, and uh, she is now 19, so she's an adult now, but um, it's not like I don't remember what it's like to be a single mom. And one of the things that made it easier for me is that I was able to use my money to buy more things because the cost of living in Missouri is very low. My own daughter was working at minimum wage when she was a senior in high school. She was working at Hardee's. She couldn't have had that job as a cashier if they had to pay her any more than that. So what you need to understand is that when the minimum wage is higher, then fewer people who are working at minimum wage will even get jobs at all. More of them will end up uh, being on welfare or simply not having an income. Um, I think one of the most wonderful things about the state of Missouri is that the cost of living is very low here. A lot of people are coming here from California. There's a huge exodus from Illinois because the taxes are high there and the minimum wage is high there and nobody can afford to live. Uh, whenever you raise the basic cost of things, what you are doing is that you are reducing the value of the money uh, that people have in their own hands. Those who have a dollar will be able to buy less with that dollar that they have. So you're not helping poor people by raising the minimum wage. You're actually taking away value from all people and if you want food at the grocery store to be less expensive, then you must pay a lower wage to all the people who work there so that um, when the people come in to pay for their goods, uh, their money will have a higher value. It's all relative. It's not like if you raise the price of something, then that is automatically going to help all the poor people. Don't buy into that. This is actually a plan to bankrupt everyone in the state. Do not act the way the people in California acted. Do not act the way the people in Illinois acted. Please understand that a low cost of living is a wonderful, wonderful thing to people who have a limited budget. Thank you. This was not sponsored by anyone. Nobody paid me to say this. This is actually what I think. Please share it with your friends so that they'll understand what real people who are not necessarily rich think about raising the minimum wage.